How to select the right hosting for your podcast. Are you wondering where you can upload your podcast audio files? Do you think uploading your podcast files to your website hosting service is okay? If you do, then you have another thing coming. In this presentation, I'm going to show you why you need a dedicated podcast hosting service and how to select the right hosting service for your podcast. First off, why shouldn't you upload your podcast audio files to your web hosting provider? Well, the answer is because audio files can get quite large. Every time someone listens to your podcast, it consumes precious bandwidth. If you have a ton of people listening to your show all at the same time, it can cause problems with your web host. So, the right course of action is to use a dedicated podcasting hosting service. Second, what are the criteria for a good podcast host? Here are some tips for you to consider. Number one, do they offer unlimited storage and unlimited bandwidth? Ideally, you want your host to have unlimited storage and bandwidth. You don't know how popular your podcast is going to get, so it's best to be prepared for the onslaught of traffic. Over time, you'll also probably publish a ton of episodes, with each audio file being several megabytes in size, so it's great to have unlimited storage space on hand. Number two, do they have optimized and distribution-ready RSS feeds? Most podcast hosts are podcast-friendly meaning they have built-in RSS feeds for easy syndication by podcast directories. This means that every time you upload a new episode, all directories where your podcast is listed will automatically be updated. Everyone who's subscribed or is following your podcast will automatically get access to your latest episodes. Number three, will they help you submit your podcast to top podcast directories? A good podcast host will make it easy for you to submit your shows to the top podcast directories. People frequently go on platforms like iTunes, Spotify, SoundCloud, etc. to look for new podcasts to listen to. Number 4. Your own podcast site You may have your own blog, but having your own podcast site is awesome as it helps build your authority. Another added benefit is that it's great for your blog's SEO since you can add a link to your blog.